Hello friends, welcome back to Technique and today we will be doing a quick speed test comparison of two flagship smartphones. We have the newly launched OnePlus 12 with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 uh, processor and uh, we have really great hardware on this device. Again, we have the iQ12, probably uh, probably the cheapest Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 powered device which retails for around 49999 and launched in December. So these are two powerful devices with LPDDR5 XRAM, UFS 4.0, Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, Android 14 out of the box so everything looks great on these two devices so which performs better uh, in terms of speed test comparison than to the benchmark score the storage test the geekbench 6 test so all these things we'll be evaluating and also the memory management of these two devices so that's the test we are going to do so let's begin so before that if this is your first time on this channel do hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so now we have the two devices with us the oneplus 12 and the iQ12 so both have a uh, pretty good hardware so we have uh, uh, both the devices so let's just take the about phone here so Oxygeno is 14, Fun Touch OS 14, both are uh, Android 14 out of the box, you can see here Android 14 and uh, both have the Snapdragon 8 uh, Gen 3 platform and uh, here also you can see a 3.3 gigahertz uh, Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 platform. Now both have 16 gigs of RAM, we have 16 gigs and here also we have 16 gigs and uh, both are again Android 14. So this is Fun Touch OS 14 and this is Oxygen OS um, uh, 14. Now we have uh, the super computing chip Q and also included here. Uh, this is uh, the fun touch OS uh, 14 so let's uh, see the speed test so let's just clear off all the background apps so there you go so we just cleared off all the background apps so let's just uh, turn on the airplane mode here now we have uh, enabled the performance mode on both the devices so that means uh, both the devices will be running on the highest performance available so here you can see here both are connected to the same Wi-Fi network both are in airplane mode so let's start the test so let's just once again clear off all the background apps. So there you go. Everything is cleared off. Let's start with Asphalt 9. So let's see which uh, performs better, which has better optimization, which has better memory management. And let's also see the network speed and also the benchmark score like the Geekbench 6 and the attitude score also the storage test. So let's first wait for Asphalt 9. So you can see here IQ was slightly faster here. So IQ was faster in the first game. Let's go to BGMI. So let's see which opens BGMI faster. So once again IQ has taken the lead here. So once again IQ has opened it faster. So you can see here. Once again uh, both the games IQ did uh, better. Next is uh, the play store. Here also IQ was slightly faster. Chrome browser again IQ was faster Facebook probably I would say almost same time now Twitter again IQ is faster Instagram again IQ is faster Spotify once again I would say IQ was faster Amazon so we'll just skip this Flipkart again IQ is faster file manager I uh, OnePlus was slightly faster settings again uh, probably OnePlus was slightly faster YouTube uh, here OnePlus was faster Gmail almost same time camera again almost same time and finally maps so here here also IQ was faster so you could see that I could did have an advantage over the OnePlus in terms of slightly faster opening time of apps but more or less uh, performance is quite good on both the devices because both are Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 powered so games of slightly faster on the IQ 12 so that is the speed test comparison let's uh, do the apps uh, in the reverse order to see the memory management how they have retained uh, the apps in the memory if all the apps are available in the memory or if anything is reloaded let's just check uh, in the reverse order so here you go so right now all the apps are available in the memory now finally moving to the games games are also available in the memory so, so there you go all the apps are available in the memory so memory management is equally good on both the devices so both of these devices did a really good job in terms of memory management next is the network speed so we'll just connect uh, both the devices to the same Wi-Fi network 
and uh, to the same uh, network as well so let's start with uh, oneplus uh, 12 So you could see exact same values here 164 171 so nothing much to differentiate now let's go to the antidote benchmark to see how they perform in terms of uh, the antidote values you can see here 17 lakh 29 this is 20 lakh 6 378 so this is definitely higher so iq uh, values are higher you can see a cpu gpu is way higher than the memory score and the ux score so these are the scores and you can clearly see that uh, iq did lead here in terms of anti to benchmark score now let's uh, also have a look at uh, the storage test so we'll just uh, test this once again so storage test uh, both have ufs 4.0 out of the box and uh, lpddr 5x ram so let's see how different they are in terms of sequential read write so almost similar 1 lakh 73 000 and 1 lakh 75 000. so read write speeds are uh, mostly similar nothing much to differentiate here and now finally the geekbench 6 results so let's just uh, take the history and uh, let's take uh, the values so 2113 is uh, one plus here 2191 is a single core score 6776 is the multi core here 6241 again not much of different multi core score is slightly higher here other than that uh, more or less similar and uh, that's the uh, benchmark score so that is the speedest comparison of um, the iq12 with the oneplus uh, 12 now if you ask me which is a faster phone probably iq would be the winner here because uh, even in anti benchmark score the geekbench score app opening time almost everything iq did have an advantage over the oneplus 12 but by a small margin only so either of these devices will give you excellent performance great software experience as well and uh, good performance especially in gaming and uh, every other aspects so that was the speed test comparison hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit that subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day